I'm Levi Sim for Photofocus.com and I wanted to introduce you to one of my very favorite camera bags. It is the Vanguard Alta Fly 49T. T is for trolley because it's got wheels, like a, like a rolling trolley. I like this bag a lot. It is just the right size. It fits in all the overhead compartments. I think it fits under my seat too, but it even fits in the overhead compartment of the CRJ700, which is quite small. I haven't tried it in the CRJ200 yet, which is potentially a little bit smaller than the 700, but um, those are the smallest airplanes I typically fly on commercially, and this bag fits inside that overhead com compartment, which is terrific. Um, this bag is well appointed with equipment, or with, with places for your equipment. I've got it loaded up. Let me show you some of the things I love about it. I love these little straps right here because when I open this up to pull out my laptop, those straps keep me from flopping everything out of the bag. And I can just open this up and pull out my laptop and put it in the security tray. I also love this shape. The, the zipper starts up here and then comes down this way, which opens up here and gives me access directly to the camera. Other bags that are shaped this way, the zipper just comes straight up and you have to actually open it up and pull the, bat, the camera straight out here. This one allows me to get access to the camera just a little bit easier by opening the top flap only. It's got a terrific handle. This goes very tall. I'm, I'm 6'2", and normally the, the handle on bags like this is just a little bit short for me. This one's a little too long, but it has multiple adjustment spots, so it works really well. I like it. It's got terrific wheels, uh, big rollerblade style wheels that are smooth and soft and rubbery. They're quiet and they roll nicely on carpet and tile at airports. I like it, it's got, you know, bags out here. It's got a, uh, it's got a rain cover. That's really nice. I live in Portland, Oregon, it rains a lot. Lots of places to stow things. There's a pocket on the outside here that is equipped with a holder for an iPad. Um, and you know, you can just stick other stuff in there. It's handy. One, one cool thing too, is this strap system on the outside. It's got these toggles that slide into the daisy chain on the outside and you can move those up and down the, the chain to hold different stuff. You can strap your, your tripod on right there. It's got a pocket here that deploys to hold your tripod. And so this little pouch, you put your legs or your head in there and then strap it down tight so it doesn't fall off the outside of the bag using those straps. I think that's a cool system, and it tucks away nicely. Oh, it's got a grab handle right here on the bottom. That's perfect. Nobody else has grab handles on the bottom of the bag, and so when it's in the overhead compartment, no matter which way I stick it in there, I can reach down and grab it. It's also got a grab handle on the side. You're always looking for a handle, and there isn't one, and I, I think that this bag solves that problem for me really nicely. Um, something else that I, I think this is the coolest thing about this bag and and I just love the idea of it so the handle is right here in the center of the of the back panel and so that handle takes up the space right there which means that the camera compartment is sitting on top of that handle section and there's there's empty space then on the sides well they took that empty space and they put two pockets here that have little handy accessory bags this is wonderful. I keep all my batteries and cords in this one. And it's, it's bright yellow, which is really cool too. It doesn't, doesn't get left behind. Um, and it's a different color than the one on this side, which I also really like. This one's the black bag, and it's got my filters and adapter rings and things that I use on my cameras on that side. I wish it was a different color, but I don't know what color. Like, I, I wish it wasn't black because it, it's easily disappears in all the black surfaces that are around me, you know, under an airplane seat or um, just on the on the side of the trail at nighttime. I, I take these bags out and I put them in my other camera bags that I go backpacking with. I think that those little pouches on the sides are really cool. I wish that one was not black, but it's great. I can say, grab me that black pouch on the right side of my bag. Grab me the yellow bag um, on, the, on the side of my pouch. Now on the inside, Got to unclip these so I can open the flip, the flap. And just in case those weren't enough, there's another clip right here that also keeps the bag from falling open. There it is. This one can connect here, 
so that your gear doesn't all come spilling out when you open it up. Um, and that's just a smart design. I like it. Uh, the camera compartment is ample. It's tall enough for large DSLRs. I use it with my uh, mirrorless kit. So my mirrorless camera goes in here, uh, my, my Lumix GH5 or my GX8, or my GH5 here, and my GX8 here, and my GX85 here, and about seven other lenses. Plus, I've got two speed lights in there, a light meter, a big camera, or a big flash bracket. Um, there's lots of room inside here for organizing your gear. Like a typical bag, but, oh, and, and it's yellow. I like the yellow because a darkly colored inside loses stuff. You can't see black camera tools, black lens caps, when they're inside a dark colored interior. So this yellow is well thought out uh, to help you find all your stuff. I think that this Alta 49, what is it, Alta Sky, no, Alta, Alta Fly 49T is a terrific bag. It's also got these great big toggles on the zipper, which makes it really easy to find the, gra the zipper poles and makes it easy to, to manipulate. I think you're gonna like this bag too and I can highly recommend it to you. Oh, there's also the stuff pouch on the side of the bag over here. Um, I usually keep a pair of gloves and some garbage bags in there. You can uh, stick other stuff down there like a light stand. Uh, there's a, a strap here to, to attach things. It's a well-appointed bag, but it remains slim and doesn't, doesn't get caught on things as I'm traveling around. Plus, I mean, it fits in the overhead on the smallest planes while still giving me tons of room. I like it, I'd recommend it. Go find it at B&H or wherever quality bags are found. I'm Levi Sim for photofocus.com.